<laughs> so you say you listening to the uh, you listen to the newest stuff. Have you heard the uh, the new Kendrick Lamar and Future song? Yes, sir. And the bars he had for uh, a certain top two rappers in the game. Yeah, I heard him. What? I heard him. Heard him. It's people, and it's, you know Kendrick though. You know, but it's people saying people kind of disappointed in J. Cole right now mm-hmm. because he apologized because he apologized I and that's, that's nothing they saying that's about. not the essence of rap to like come out and mm-hmm. get somebody back and then take it back and stuff like that i don't think mm-hmm. i don't think i, think I don't that fault was very him human yeah i don't fault yeah. him for the apology very i big. feel like you know mm-hmm. he real like he probably be touching grass and hugging trees like y'all you know <laughs> exactly so that's <laughs> yeah. why he, he was like spirit. you know what exactly. that was, that was so dress. childish yeah, so I think he was honest, you right. know, like he gave into the peer pressure, you know what I mean? Right, that's what he said. In his he apology. titled it "Might Delete Later." That says everything. Right, he felt a way about it before he even de- dropped it. Yeah, you know what I'm saying. So and it's like it, you need to, to listen you to your original gut and mm-hmm. intention. You called it might delete later. You should have just deleted it out of your text messages. <laughs> <laughs> like, you know what I mean? Unless it was already the original intention. I mean, peer pressure can be a motherfucker, though. And when you got the top rapper in the game, like, dropping bars about you, of course, everybody. He said everybody was like, it's wartime, nigga. Yeah. Stuff like yeah, that. Yeah, but all know? they do is talking. Like, why Why nobody fight? <laughs> Damn. <laughs> she said put the gloves on. <laughs> But that's what I like about it's it. Though. Cold all, world. That, all that talking. That's what like, I like about get it. Get out though, in the street, just knock yourself out, and that's it. Y'all over there. We've seen yeah. so, many, so many beats that. get out of hand and stuff. You mm-hmm. know, it starts in the music. Yeah. And Cole got really like out of character in the song. Like, as yeah. I was listening to it, he was talking about guns and shooting this and that. And mm-hmm. it didn't even sound like he believed what right. he was saying in the song. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah. He don't yeah. even seem the type to pull out a gun. He not. I'm telling I don't know what you. Yeah. Say. He said it. He was just his reaction wasn't his. It was his peers. It was his people around him. That's mm-hmm. why it's important to watch who you surround What's yourself around with. Him. Ooh, you I like that. Saying? Absolutely. Period. Even if it, they they was hot in the moment, it's like if that's not you, you got to remember who you are. You know, not be wavered, and you know, I think that that getting that, getting pushed. Yeah, pushed, that desire for, for validation. Mm-hmm. It could kill us. Yep. Right, but he got a lot of pressure on him. You know, they call him one of the top top three in the game and stuff like they that. They was calling him. Yeah, they was calling. It's getting him. crazy out now. Like you feel, at least see how people, how fast people turn. You yeah, know what I'm saying? Know, like they was just, they was just praising him, and now it's just like, oh, we done with you. You know? Oh yeah, because I saw one uh, one some guy on the podcast. He was like, oh yeah, I'm about to take all the posters down. I'm about to throw my shoes away. Da, 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 da. <laughs> like if you was really a J Cole fan for so many years, why would you even say that? Right. Like right. you ride with somebody that you rock with, doesn't matter good or bad. So that means you just like that that part of mm-hmm. him, but you're not really that mm-hmm. of a fan. Well, of I don't him, think it's so. really his Cut fans. The that are turning on him, I think it's like the fly by night, just hip hop fans that are a fan of that a beef rap type that thing. Beef rap, and, I guess you know, it's like yeah. some type of art or something. I I personally don't understand what this rap beef stuff is about. Maybe because yeah. from where I grew up and how mm-hmm. I handle my problems, <laughs> definitely not. Yeah, I, say, I think but, it's just the sport. It's the sport of it. The white, y'all better be like, glad I'm, I'm not saying? a rapper. <laughs> like the way people want to watch boxing matches, the way people want to watch the final four March Madness, they want to hear their favorite artists go at it. Yeah, right. Is what it is. But you people know? feed off of negativity, like they, they do. do. Post a positive it. post. Post a negative post. See, oh, exactly. <laughs> see which one get more likes. See which one get more comments. You know, that's just the nature that we in. So True I that. think once he dropped that joint, it was like, you know, he was open to you know whatever was to happen, and I don't think he, you know, anticipated um, the reviews to be so harsh as right. far as like you know. J. Cole versus Kendrick, you know, it was it was dark. You know right. what I mean? And like we said, we hugging trees, you know what I mean? Yeah, like, touching grass. We, like, we, we ain't with the beef, honey. Sit good. We're that not didn't, with that it. didn't sit right with him. I feel you. I knew it wouldn't. <laughs> right, right. You knew it wouldn't when you named it Mike Lee later. Mm. You really got to go with your gut. Yeah, that's, that was... So, so why do you think people feed off of or feel so entertained by negativity like mm. that? What, what, what Man, is that? Why, I think why misery is that? loves company. Yeah, Oof. hurt people hurt yeah. people and shit. Mm-hmm. I think majority of people are, you know, the lesser than the greater when it comes to my mindset, mentality. And that's because 
the world that we live in has, you know, just to come to ah, just such a dark place. You know what I mean? Like, it's tough. I blame it's social tough. media, man. Social media. Social if you look media, at the comments on the social pandemic. media. Yeah, the pandemic. <laughs> the pan- Ooh, the pandemic. That was that, it. That was that put us in a dark place, man. Social media is just documenting it. And it's getting better and better. And cameras is getting greater and greater. Oh, yeah. Yep. A new iPhone 15. Because I, I, <laughs> I don't think that's like a new thing. 16 like, on the way. You know? 16 on the way. It's like, bro, they capturing capsules right now. Yeah, yeah. But they if you ever pixels, if you ever got into like a beef situation with somebody, do you think you would ever like bury the hatchet and like mm-hmm. come back mm-hmm. around and be like, yeah, I would be willing to. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Wow. Yeah. For sure. Nobody gonna just get at me, and I'm not gonna say nothing though. Like I'll, you, I'm gonna respond. Would you? Yeah. In, would you initiate the? Nah, I'm not initiating nothing. Oh, okay. Never. No bigger. But you hugging trees, you can't be the bigger person? I ain't initiating it. Oh, okay. Okay. That's what I'm so saying. I, don't, That's I could always be the, you know what I mean, the person to say, yeah, let's drop it. But initiating, you talking about initiating what? Uh, uh, the beef? The apology. Oh, initiate? Nah, 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 nah. Okay. Aries, we finished. We just finished it. Okay. Okay. <laughs> That's it. 